Imagine a metal-coated AFM tip in close proximity to a molecule. When an external laser is focused onto the tip sample area, the molecule becomes polarized and an induced dipole is created. A mirror image dipole is also created in the metal tip, and the attractive force between these two dipoles will pull the cantilever toward the sample. Because the apex of the AFM tip is very sharp, the interaction area of the sample is tiny, around 10 nanometers. The resulting force is on the order of just a few piconewtons. We use a resonance of the AFM cantilever to amplify this small signal. To do so, we pulse the excitation laser at the resonant frequency of the cantilever so that the synchronous attractive pulling of the tip due to the photo-induced polarization will excite the cantilever to oscillate. The magnitude of the oscillation amplitude is proportional to the strength of the photo-induced polarization. We call this signal photo-induced force, or PIFM. If we sweep the wavelength, the PIFM signal will be much stronger at electronic and vibrational resonances of the sample. This PIFM spectrum correlates well with visible and infrared absorption spectra as measured by instruments like FTIR. If we now move the sample so that the green molecule is underneath the tip, we can record its PIFM spectrum, which has different peaks than the yellow molecules. We can repeat this process to build up a grid of n by n pixels, each pixel containing sample height and a local PIFM spectrum. This image, which we call a hyper-nano image, contains rich spectral, or chemical, information at the nanoscale.